interesting i mean this name was given by the people of the industry and consumers seeing that i was the first women entrepreneur in this sector to bring in a technology which is um state of art well advanced and uh, something which helps and uh, glorifies energy storage basically so that's how i got this name as battery wali i mean in india people have an habit of you know associating wali or wala with whatever kind of work that you do so that's how i got this name <laughs> is when i started working towards gender equality and women empowerment the first thing i did was i wanted to have equality in my own company so we started that was the first step that we took it was not easy at all to have that equality and con- consistently maintain that so we have tried our level best and with god's grace and with my hr's grace and my team's grace we are still equal at the show, at, at all levels here in the company now something that we all need to understand is that uh, we have to treat women equally i mean an engineer is an engineer that is first aspect from the employer's point of view second comes from the employee point women employee point of view is that she also should be ready to do anything and everything that has been allocated as a fair work to her i have used the word fair work here. so you know what i mean to say here that the women and the men in the company should be given the same work as per their uh, category and caliber and both should be treated alike i mean okay just because she is a female she will not go to a certain locations or maybe she is a man he is asked to do certain kind of work more no don't do that discrimination until and unless the employee whoever man or a woman comes up and says that this is something that i cannot do until then allow them give them a fair opportunity and ask them if they are willing to do these kind of things or not and that would change the way we see the approach towards women first treat all of them alike an engineer is an engineer or a you know a typist is a typist or a whatever i mean whatever is the role is just role it's not about the gender who is behind that role so once we have that mindset clear things are much more easier having women in the manufacturing having women on the key positions change the way the organizational behavior takes place and i have seen that personally when despite having uh, you know when we sh- uh, shifted all the important key positions and allocated them to women uh, employees there we saw a lot of change in the growth pattern we saw a lot of change in the mindset of uh, the people looking at it and uh, they had more sensitivity towards the entire workforce and the whole uh, you know that aggression and the loudness it just mellowed and that helped everyone grow it it was so peaceful and it's very peaceful now everybody is peaceful it grows very well it becomes beautiful to work at see basically uh, in an any office that you go maximum time of your day is that is where you spend at your workplace and if you're not happy at your workplace it no transformation can take place neither yours nor the company where you're working with so both need to be a very in a very happy and a very uh, you know contented space to actually grow so that is where i think women play a very important role but of course it is so both men and women are equally important i would not say that only women are important both are important both need to be together to take this entire thing forward you just cannot have one of the genders so equality at every level